it's me Max Rambo and I'm back for another video. So today I'm going to be reacting to Russia's entry for Junior Eurovision 2018. The entry is called Unbreakable by Anna Philipchuk. Phil Philipchuk. Philipchuk. Oh, okay. Obviously I'm gonna have high hopes for Russia because I really liked them last year and they ended up winning. I'm a little bit sad that they're not hosting um, just because, I don't know, they won. Like, they should get to host. But whatever. And Russia's great host, like we know from regular Eurovision. So regardless, I have high hopes. So we're going to see. Let me put on my glasses so I can actually see the video. And let's react. I love her style. It's so like swaggy. Like she's got style. I don't quite know what's going on, but it's very modern, the sound, I can tell. I don't think it's going to be as serious as last year's entry. They're bringing in a little bit more back to, you know, junior Eurovision. It's low-key got, like, the same build-up as Wings, though. Okay, it sounds like a song I've heard before. Like, that sounds like something I've heard before. So she's singing to a group of kids and there's a panda. She's collecting these orange shards. She's got her box braids. Or not box braids, like dust braids. I'm confused, I don't know what she, so the song's called Unbreakable, so it's like a confident song. Release your feelings, wake up and shine. So just like, you know, live your life, that's what they're saying, right? Okay. It's not Water of Life or Wings, I'm just gonna say it, like it's not. It's fine. I don't like this chorus. It's too soft. I want like, you know, to like, bring you in. It's too twinkle twinkle, like soft, like little kid. But the build up doesn't feel like you're gonna get to that point, right? Like it, like I expect it to like, boom. And it doesn't do that. It's too safe. It was fine, it was good, but it wasn't... I don't know, that wasn't very, um... Yeah, I think I said what I needed to say throughout, um... The reaction, like, I just feel like it was a little bit too... Safe, um... It was a little... It sounds too familiar. Um, it's good, but it... Uh, I don't know, I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, I don't really... I don't know if I'm a fan of that or not. Huh. Interesting. I, I'm just a little bit disappointed because like the last two years, like Water of Life and Wings were really, really good. And this was not that good. So, um, I think I'm going to give it a, I, there's part of me that wants to give it a six because it's not that I don't like it, right? But then there's part of me that wants to give it a four because I don't like it. So I'll give it a five because that's the middle ground. I just don't know how to feel about this. Um, but it's not like Kazakhstan where I don't know how to feel about it. But I like I don't know how to feel about it because it's different and it's this is 
I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of like left me speechless. Like, I just don't know how to feel about it. I think I'm going to go with a 5 out of 10. So yeah, guys, that is it for my reaction of Russia in the Junior Eurovision Song Contest 2018. If you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Maxi Rainbow. That's my main channel. So you don't miss out on any Eurovision, Junior Eurovision drag, any of the content that I do. And yeah, guys, my name is Max Rainbow. I will see you all later. Goodbye. Mwah.